Hello everyone and this is David from goldstartool.com golden cutting and sewing supplies and today we're gonna showcase Juki LU-1560N. <clears throat> I'm sure by now you're gonna say hey we have one of these videos done but we don't have it with this all these toolers and look at what we got here. I'm gonna show you what it is. So this is a 1560 double needle walking foot by Juki but the customer requested to have a puller and people call us hey we need a puller and they think it's only a small, tiny uh, uh, piece of puller in the back. No, it's a major, major thing. I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna show you this thing. And then if I could get the tape measure, El Metro, so I could show you this guy, that the whole table is different, the setup is different. They requested the T-leg, the T-leg is very, very heavy duty. And uh, honestly, it's a, uh, the, uh, the puller is the, it's a huge thing. You see, we had to cut the fab table and make sure that the, the puller sits inside the table. Look at this, uh, <clears throat> belt. Here, the timing belt right here, the whole, the whole, the whole entire thing. It's, I just gonna go over the uh, uh, brand name of the puller. It is Racing, and this is P2. Racing, and this is P2. P2 is used for mostly heavy walking foot sewing machine. So the customer is doing a very high, um, high speed sewing of a belt that it needs to be pulled constantly. And that's what they wanted. This, this is gonna cost about, if you go to our website, you'll see, I think P2 is gonna cost about uh, 1500 bucks. And then you have to pay us to install it, the machine, the whole thing. So um, this machine and we did all the installation and everything. Okay, so here, I'm gonna show you how it's done, but before we go, I had to do some changes. Threading is very important. I'm gonna try to do a lot of threading now these days because people don't know how to thread and they call us and say, hey, I, want, I don't want my machine, my machine is not working. And it all had to do with threading. Threading is 99% of sewing. If you're threading it right, if you know how to thread it, then the machine is gonna work. So this is for bobbin winder right here. The thread we're using today is a new tech or gold star 207 thread. We have here 138 for the bobbin. We have the heavy one right here, just to show you how it's gonna work. You're gonna go through this thread, start right here, go through that small tiny tension. You could adjust here, and then it's gonna go to the bottom up. And then you put this on, this is automatic bobbin winder. The other one, the two, it's gonna go through the top, come here, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out. And then they're gonna go through this hole right here. And I hope you guys could see it's getting dark outside. Here. And if you could come here, it's gonna go below this, below this. So even over inside here and under this here, and then we're gonna go onto inside the first one. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Okay, and then you pull it down, make sure it's inside, right? Pull it, make sure it's inside here, down, you see? And then it's gonna come, and it's gonna go bottom. It's gonna come up, and you feel it's gonna feel inside, and it's gonna go inside. This thread guide right here, and all of this thing has to be done with tiny fingers. So you need one of these, and it's gonna go toward the top one, the take up lever. And that's number one. So when you're pulling, I'm sorry, 
Lindsay, you gotta show this. When you're pulling this, you gotta, this should happen right here. That is how the tension is gonna work, all right? And if you wanna pull more, all you have to do is press this. It's gonna release these two tension, you see? Press more. If you wanna press and get more thread out, okay? You could also do the same thing by pressing the uh, knee lifter right here, okay? Now, we're gonna do the second one, the second thread. In, out, in, coming in, going here, inside that hole, going on top. Just you gotta make sure that when it's going to, it's gonna fall into this, and then under here, through this one, Hold the thread, make sure go inside of it. And then, now again the same thing. When, they should really put me on Netflix. <laughs> I think so. I think that, because this is really a family, uh, you know, episode, I mean, PG, PG is good now. I mean, hey, Netflix people, I'm ready for you guys. <laughs> okay, you're gonna put it through, and then it's gonna go through the second hole, bottom hole, the lower hole, out, and both of them are gonna go through. Again, excuse the noise in the background, we have a lot of, it's okay, we're busy, it's good that we're busy. No problem. These are very important. It's gonna go through this thread guide and it's holidays and we're busy and we're happy that we're busy and we're doing a lot of shipping, we're doing a lot of assembly and we're gonna be busy and there is a noise in the background and uh, it's all good. The first one is gonna come out and the second one is gonna come out right here. All right, and then you're gonna put it right underneath this thread guide again. You pull it out, put it underneath, let it go, and then you put this one. Okay, done. Pull more if you want, right? And then I'm gonna pull that up. These are the old one, the, I mean the the other thread, I'm gonna pull this thread out. I'm gonna pull this thread out. And now it's here. I'm gonna put them through again. One more time. Okay. And then, again, these are 138 thread, but you could go easy with this machine to 207 thread. Bonded nylon thread made by Gold Star. We have them on our website. We have uh, 69. We have, I mean, the first time this is gonna take you a little bit of time, but then you're gonna be okay. So again, another hole right here. down, see, and another one down. This is a quarter inch gauge, meaning the space between two needles are quarter. Could be three eight, could be five sixteen, could be quarter, could be uh, half, three quarter, one inch. So it has to be adjusted. Top. Loaded, both sides. Top loaded, left and right. And it's vertical. And whenever it's vertical, meaning the hook, instead of, uh, what do you call this way? This is vertical, this is? Top load? Top load. Side. We have top load. Vertical is this, right? Oh, horizontal. Horizontal. Mm -hmm. The horizontal, thank you, thank you. English 101. 
So horizontal, it had less power. Mm. This is more power to it, that way. And this is extra large bobbin. This is not M bobbin. This is larger than M bobbin. Um, you've seen the other video. So top two, left bobbin. I mean the hook and right, top load. Okay, so when I say the change, if you anybody needs to change the gauge, the, we have it on our website. I'm not gonna get into it. Again, and now left to right. In, see, I have my boss next to me, to my left hand side. Yes. And right, okay, so this way. Now, this machine again, we have attached a puller. Was it PL or LP puller? I forgot, I forgot. I'm gonna come up with, I'm gonna take a look one more time. PT, right? PT, mm -hmm. thank you, good memory, PT. So. I don't think this is something that you could uh, attach, but if you are good and you're a very, very, very good engineer, mm. you could do it. The whole system goes back in there, uh, attach it, it has its own computer in the back, or control box, let me show you. People are gonna ask, this is the control box mm. for this one, for the whole unit right here. There's the tension for the puller. Uh, I think the puller, you could either get a rubber or the one with the teeth. So we got the one with the rubber. Everything could be adjusted, oil, everything. And it comes with the booklet also. Uh, it has its own, uh, it goes, uh, it gets electricity from the control box to turn on and off the sewing machine. Uh, okay, so now when I, Want to, when I sew, I usually like to go to hold this because, and go down and lock it up and sew. And I'm gonna get rid of all this thread. Okay, more, and we're gonna go. So this is for long running uh, production. Whenever I go back there, you look at the foot, whenever I do my knee lift, the roller goes back up. Whenever I wanna do reverse, it come back up the roller in the back. You see that? It's all connected. And whenever I start sewing, the roller turns. You see? So. One more thing I want to tell you, there is a top and a bottom roller. It's not only top one, there is one on the bottom, right here. This is a roller. And according to the, according to the way you want to, according to the fabric that you have, you could adjust the tension from here. Like right before I came here to adjust, they told me that fabric is, uh, is bunching up here. So I adjusted the tension. I gave it less tension. If you give it more tension, and when you go doing more tension, see, it's gonna, it's gonna press, it's gonna be more press here, and then you see, things bunch up, right? So I do less tension. It, what I'm trying to say it has to do with what type of fabric you work with. So I'm gonna let it go, you see, wow. My mama should be too proud of me. <laughs> right or not? Okay, now, this is how many layers is this? Four. I'm going to do eight. No problem. No problem. I'm going to get it put it through. Right? Easy. And then when you stop, you want to go? See? Everything comes up, so you could pull everything up. If you want to go reverse, now reverse. That's the reverse. No problem. And then when you want to pull it up, just press and hallelujah, praise the Lord. Here we go. Let me see the back. 
Look at the back. Look at the front. This is eight layers. I could even do more. I don't want to do it because there is no oil inside. Now, people are going to say how the table, how big the table should be. People don't have a lot of room. 424. I think the original one is 21, that we do, right? It's 21 by 48. Everything is included when you order. Meaning when you order that puller, you're gonna get, get this switch. Uh, you're gonna get this switch right here. You see there's the switch right here. Uh, you're gonna get the control box in the back. Everything, rubber, out, on, inside, outside. Again, LU1560 with a attachment a puller Unbelievable, this is ready to go. Uh, by the way, a lot of people do tent, and this tent has a huge tent, and it's much, much thicker, and they use this one. This is unbelievable. Uh, or any other stuff that you need a puller. The puller will help you pull, and you know, you don't need to constantly go like this. Anyway, David from goldstartools.com. We have that product on our website. Even if you have one of these already at home and you want to add this, you could do it. You just remember that in the back, you're going to need four inch more, which still you're good with the regular table that you have. You're going to be hundred percent okay. Again, I'm sorry for the noise in the background. We're perfect. We're good. Happy holidays to everybody. Thank you for watching. This is David from goldstartool.com. That goldstartool.com. Netflix people, contact my people. I have people. You could contact my people. Thank you. Bye-bye.